ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पाकटेक यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट टू टू वन मल्टीप्लेक्सर और टू टू वन मक्सिमुलेशन विद इन द मल्टीजम एज वी नो दैट मल्टीप्लेक्सर आर दी डेटा सेलेक्टर्स विच आर यूज फॉर टू सेलेक्ट द स्पेसिफिक इनपुट टू बी गॉन टू द आउटपुट there are two types of lines input lines like uh, one is called as the selector line and the other is called as the data line data lines used to input data into the multiplexer and selector lines or selection lines will control the uh, selection of data lines so let's start the simulation and you will get the proper concept then now we will click on play source now it is our dc power source we can say that it is a dc power source and after it we need two and gates for it we will go to our ttl and we will see for our and gates now this is our 7 408 j and get so we need to select two of these nand gates okay and this one okay and this one after this nand gate we need one not gate so 7405 is our not gate okay we we just need one not get okay now the output of these and gets must be given to an or get so we will go for one or get go to ttl and search for or get so Okay, we will search for OR gate. So, because there are two input AND gates, so we just need two input OR gate. So, properly search for it. Yeah, this is our OR gate. So, press OK. click on a and this one okay now connect the output of the and gates to the input of the or gate and one more thing that you also need to place an indicator on the output of the or gate so we will go for indicator and like this and this our indicator it must be on the output of the or gate like this in the last we need one ground and two dip switches okay now or three dip switches because there is also an and gate so okay we will go to our basic mode and we will click on our switches switch so we will go for dip switch one okay now this is one dip switch for and gate and this is the second input for dip switch two okay now in the last we need one ground also change the voltages of the power supply to 5 volt because 12 volt is too much for these simple semiconductor devices okay now we need to connect 
one end of the key switches with the end gate okay now we need to connect the first end gate with the inverted side of the inverted side of the not gate and one and one with the what's called is the non inverted side or we can say that before inverted before inverted one okay also after it we need one more switch so we will go for one more switch so we will copy and paste so it must be copy and then it needs to be pasted okay so Okay, now we need to run it out. It is taking a bit of time to start the simulation. Now you can see that our our first switch or our first the data is going to the output and the second switch or second data line is not having any sort of impact on the output. Okay now we will close the switch and then we will see that either. Now you can see that our second data line is sending data on the output and our first is not having any sort of impact on the output so with the help of this selection line or third or selection line we can we can send our either first uh, data line data to the output or the second data line data to the output so it is a very simple concept within the multi sim so hopefully you got this concept so thanks for visiting our channel.